Well, the most important thing is to realize there's no adjuvants you can take that are going to improve your eggs. In other words, I can tell you things that are advocated. DHEA, which is a male hormone, is advocated. All the scientific control studies show that it doesn't help, it only hurts. Because it is a male hormone, and that's the last thing that your uh, follicles and granulosa cells need is male hormone. Uh, it, but it just absolutely doesn't do any good. The theory is that that male hormone can be converted by granulosa cells into female hormones, estrogen, and that estrogen would be good for the egg quality. That's a theory. It's an interesting theory, but it was disproven 10 years ago, disproven five years ago. Just It absolutely does no good. It's But it becomes like a myth on the internet. It's everywhere. And you know how false ideas and rumors arise because enough people are saying it that when people hear it, they say, well, it's got to be true because everybody knows it's true, but it isn't true. And that's how confusion and misinformation spreads. It's all uh, it's issue of rumor. And in this era of uh, Internet and social media, rumors, of course, are, are rampant. So, no, DHEA doesn't help. Uh, there's the idea that um, uh, that you can have platelet-rich plasma injected into your ovary and improve the eggs. That's all baloney. That, that's fraudulent. It, it absolutely doesn't do any good for the egg, and uh, we, we know that it doesn't do any good for the egg. You can't rejuvenate the egg that way. Uh, about all we can recommend is you don't take any dietary supplements that could have a negative effect. And we do mini IVF because with mini IVF with a small dose of FSH and LH, not HCG, but a small dose of LH, that we can be more likely to get a good quality egg at 42. And we don't want to overstimulate. If we pound you with high doses of drugs like 600 IU gonadotropin, we're not going to get any more eggs from a 42-year-old, but we will ruin the eggs that we do get. So we got to tease them out delicately with low doses. And uh, kind of like an example I give is an apple tree. If you're under an apple tree, uh, you know, you have a choice. You can shake the tree and the few apples near the bottom that are ripe and ready will fall off. Or you can chop down the whole tree and and go for all those other apples and they're not any good and they're not ready to eat. So uh, we've got to tease it carefully to get the best quality eggs, but none of the adjuvants, growth hormone, there are so many adjuvants that are talked about to try to improve those eggs in a 42 year old and, and they won't. All, all you can do is ruin them. So we give you some stimulation so that we can get a follicle and get the egg out of the ovary or the eggs out of the ovary. But this massive stimulation can't possibly improve the quality of those eggs or even get you more eggs. So it's important to avoid the, the phony baloney ideas. Mm -hmm.